Hi, my name is Devin Jackson Randall or DJ Ara and welcome to Queer Fidanchi. So let's talk. Today is Friday and that means it's time for the weekly update. If you guys don't know, the weekly update is where I let you guys know about LGBT themed media news. Uh, that could be anything from casting announcements to upcoming video games, movies, TV shows, things like that. Uh, it could be what BL games are currently being kickstarted, blah blah blah, all that and more you can find at the weekly update. So let's get started. Oh, reminder, uh, you can find section times in the description down below as well as the link to the blog post. First, we have some news, some pretty exciting news about My Gay Roommate. If you guys have not checked out My Gay Roommate, it is a web series that you can find here on YouTube. My Gay Roommate was one of the most prominent web series on YouTube, and definitely the most popular LGBT web series. The series is about Nick Cohen, the college gay roommate, um, who is roommates and best friends with the straight man, Max. And this series really, well, the first season really follows these two in the romance best friendship way. And so this news that I'm actually talking to you about, there's actual news, it's not an echo blast. Uh, the thing that's actually happening is that Noam Ash, the creator and the guy who plays Nick Cohen, has come out on Kickstarter and said that uh, My Gay Roommate is being produced as a TV show. Currently he is in works with, uh, in dealings with Ish Entertainment, which is a TV production entertainment company in New York City. The TV show is planned, it will happen no matter what. Currently, he is kickstarting the show so that they can get some extra money to fluff the show up. Uh, right now, they just have enough money for the bare essentials, but he wants to make sure that the show will look great, will be great, and as wonderful as it can be. So if you guys have checked out My Gay Remain, the web series, if you haven't, go check it out. If you have, go check out this Kickstarter. You can back it for only $10 and hopefully make this into a wonderful TV show. Uh, in America though, so I don't know if this will get going international, but hopefully if you guys show enough attention to it, he can get that out there to international purposes and cool or something, I don't know. But anyway, go check that out. Following that, we have a casting announcement for Jen Richards. If you don't know who Jen Richards is, I also uh, did a review for one of her stories. She did her story, which actually I talked about a couple days ago on this YouTube channel. Her story uh, was a web series that she created. She was one of the creators and one of the stars. It's the story of the dating lives of queer women, lesbian women, and trans women. And uh, specifically, she wanted to show, uh, just show a real story about trans women and really show that they're not just men in disguise. They're not just people to be disgusted by. They are human beings, right? And so at, following the success of that Emmy-nominated web series, she has now been announced, it has now been announced that she is being signed on for a TV show. And this TV show is Nashville. If you guys are outside of America or you just don't know what this show is, it's sort of a country music TV show. I haven't watched it because I'm not really country, um, but it is a country TV show uh, starring uh, famous people like Hayden Panettiere, if you don't know her, she was in shows like Heroes, which was very popular at the time, at the time being like four or five years ago. The show is, it has a cult following, I guess. Uh, it is on now CMTV. Uh, this is actually a historic moment because uh, Jen Richards is now going to be the first trans actress on the channel, as well as playing the first trans character on the channel. So, congratulations, Jen Richards. And lastly, we have another TV announcement. This is actually for British TV now and not American. This TV show called The Bisexual has actually just been announced as being a greenlit to run. This is the time when UK and American TV channels are announcing which shows they have greenlit to be produced and which shows they have burned down to the ground. So this show, The, the Bisexual, has been announced to continue. This show is a series about an American girl who moves to London and really tries to network the dating scene of both straight and gay society in London. Um, this story is interesting. It sounds interesting. It's really, they're trying to make it sound like it's really going to be a real portrayal of the 
gay and straight dating lives in London from an outsider's perspective. It's also saying that it's going to portray London life from an outsider's perspective, which I think is really cool. In addition, the TV series will be written by and star uh, Iranian-American actress. Oops, I'm gonna focus for a second to get this. Desiree Akhavan. Okay, Desiree Akhavan. Um, this actress uh, is a uh, director, she has done a lot of her own projects, kind of like Jen Richards, and now she's getting her own show, or getting onto, well, her own show, she's getting her own show in uh, British television on Channel 4, so if you guys have access to Channel 4, uh, or if you guys just want to try to find it somewhere else, then go check that out, The Bisexual, sounds interesting. Oh, and it's a comedy, by the way, it's not a drama, it's a comedy, so it's haha, -ha. Perspect perspectives. <laughs> And that is it for this weekly update. Let me know down in the comments below what your thoughts are or on all these, on all these stories. Uh, let me know down below if I missed anything important of this week. I don't know, I might have just missed some big news, some big celebrity just doing some big LGBT movie or something, I don't know. Let me know down in the comments below if I did. If you liked this video, make sure to like it, guys. Uh, comment, subscribe, always subscribe, all of that. And I hope you guys are doing well. So, let's get talking. Bye.